Hello, today I'm going to be going over how to upload your DXF shapes and cutouts to the front panel designer. So in order to do this, you need to do it in two parts. And the first part would be uploading your shape. So go up to the top left hand corner and click on create new front panel. Then in basic shape, you'll click on free shape from DXF file and then import DXF file. Then you'll take the DXF shape file that you have and add it to the front panel designer. You'll want to choose your thickness for your panel, so I'm going to choose 2.5 millimeters. And then you'll also want to choose your material. I'll choose anodized aluminum and the color of your panel, so I'll choose blue. If you have any edge machining you want to add to your panel, just click on that here and add it. Click OK. And then once you're done with this, just click OK and your DXF shape will be uploaded to the front panel designer. Now you're able to insert your DXF cutouts. So to do this, just go up to the top toolbar and click on Insert Free Contour. Once this has been selected, you can just click anywhere on the panel and the free contour properties will pop up. So then just click import and you can select your cutouts file. So you can see here that there is some red in some of the cutouts. This is due to the tool size selected being too large. So you need to change your tool size to a smaller tool. Just use the drop down box here. I've selected two millimeter and you can see that this cutter tool is the right size and they're no longer red. So then select OK and your cutouts will appear on the screen. But now your cutouts need to be centered on the panel. So just right click on the cutouts and click on align and distributing. Then make sure the boxes center and center are checked and click OK. And once you've done this, your cutouts are now centered on your panel and you've successfully uploaded your shape and cutouts. Thank you.